We're glad you're with us. First at six, dozens of new jobs are coming to the city of Muskogee. It comes after Captive Air doubled the size of its Muskogee operation. The company opened a new 130,000 square foot facility today. I learned how the investment is impacting the community. A lot of growth, a lot of opportunity. You can hear the cut of the ribbon officially celebrating a major expansion in Muskogee. Captive Air, a company that manufactures commercial kitchen ventilation systems and HVAC equipment, has been in the community for 26 years. We've grown year over year historically, and now this is just another uh, monumentous point for us and, and a real critical growth point for the company. Shane McCullough is the plant manager. He says the $30 million expansion has already brought about 60 jobs to the area with another 40 on the way in the next year. We want Captive Air to be the number one employer in Muskogee. That's our goal. McCullough says company-wide, the Muskogee plant is one of its most productive facilities. And the investment is something State Senator Dwayne Pemberton says isn't just a win for Muskogee, but the state as a whole. Economic development and growth is our number one priority. Trying to bring better jobs into the state of Oklahoma. So as you bring better jobs in, you raise the standard of living for people, you bring more money in. We caught up with Ren Stratton, the chair of the City of Muskogee Foundation, after a tour of the new building. This is a win-win on so many levels. She says Captive Air has already filled some jobs with graduates of Indian Capital Technology Center in town, and she's hoping it'll provide even more opportunities for community members. The ripple out is tremendous. I mean, there not only is the, the initial investment, but the expansion investment, the workforce, um, what that does for jobs. The company's president says the new facility will allow them to have shorter lead times and faster replacement timelines.